Welcome to Dude RV. We've got an airplane in the background. I sure appreciate you stopping by. I'm down in the heart of Texas, Waco Lake, spending New Year's at Waco Lake. But today I find myself at an airport park on Waco Lake. And it's called Airport Park because there's an airport right over that hill. How convenient. So I've got Little Red, the high-speed mobility scooter. I have the GoPro Hero 9 with the Max Lens Mod. And best of all, I have you. So let's go take a virtual ride, a virtual tour, first-person view tour of Waco Lake Airport Park. Let's ride. Cue the music. Now, I've not been overly impressed by the day use areas here at Waco Lake, but I, we both, Yappy and I, Yappy and I both, have been very impressed with the two campgrounds that we've visited, Airport Park and Spiegelville Park. I had no idea that these parks on Waco Lake were so nice. This is just been a, a very pleasant surprise. And we've got speed bump. We'll just follow the Viking. That's where we're, we're going where they're going anyway. It is New Year's Eve 2021. It is currently 75 degrees. Tomorrow, no, it's not New Year's Eve. Yeah, it is New Year's Eve. Tomorrow's New Year's Day. It's going to be 75 tomorrow. And then tomorrow night, it's going to be 21. <laughs> it's going to be really cold. So the first loop we're going to visit here at Airport Park is the cabin loop, the, the shelters. Now these green shelters are are really nice and some of them are like right on the water there's also an RV loop here that will slide through <laughs> now these are full connection sites So far, these are the only full connection sites that I have found on Waco Lake. But two of the four RV camping loop or campgrounds on Waco Lake are currently closed. So we'll actually have to make a return visit at some point to Waco Lake. I would be on camping right underneath the approach for the, the airport's runway. A nice cabin. Roads are pretty rough out here though. Of course y'all don't y'all don't have to see the the shaking of the camera thanks to the GoPro technology. Go down here for this really rough loop. Currently Waco Lake is low. Now how low? I, I don't know because I've not ever been out here camping before so I don't know how low it 
big it really is but it looks to me like it's about 10 feet below normal wind is really picking up we've got a rainstorm coming in this evening camping loop, or not loop, but every campground has a boat ramp, and then there are a number of public access so that you don't have to actually go into the campground to put your boat in the water. This is a really steep boat ramp, so you're going to have to be careful and respectful. There you go. Get back up the hill. We'll switch back in. All right, now they have a day use area. We've visited for airport, for airport park, there's a day use area. Not impressed, not impressed at all. Uh, it, most of it was closed off uh, and it looked very, very neglected. Of course, that may just be because it's off season. <laughs> you gotta slow down so y'all can see your sights. Oh, full connections over here too. Usually a 
nice look of the, of the lake though. Get through the gravel. And we can kind of see the back side of that, that group pavilion. So if you're going to do a, an RV gathering, a rally in the Waco area, that would be an excellent location. Excellent location for you. So we're gonna come back out this way. We're actually gonna drive this little stretch of road twice as we do a loop-de-loop. -loop. Lots of little kids fishing. that about all of them. There's a fellow Navy veteran hanging the flag, flying the flag. All right. We're almost done. One more loop to explore. We go a little faster now. primitive loop but there are some really nice sights way out here on this point in view of the dam Waco Lake. I certainly appreciate you coming along for the ride. If you found this to be fun, entertaining, and or informative, I would be, I would really appreciate it if you would click on that thumbs up and share me on your social media. That really helps with the YouTube algorithm. And if this is your first visit to Dude RV, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on that subscribe button right down there, that red one hit that with you know and make sure you hit that bell as well so you'll be notified every time i post a new video i post a minimum of two videos a week and most of those are campground related for those of you who have been following along thank you that's why we're here that's that's why we're at waco lake 
and for my patrons, you rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?